How to customize product page in Shopify Dawn Team. Hello guys and welcome to today's video. In today's video, we will be teaching you how you will be able to customize the product page of your products on your online store. Now, for this video, we will be specifically editing the Shopify Dawn Team. So make sure that you are using the Dawn Team by going here on the online store on the themes and you will be able to see here what type of theme is currently installed on your online store and as you can see the dawn theme is currently installed as our theme now this is how you will be able to edit the product page you're going to have to click on customize over here and you will be redirected to the editing page of shopify now after here as you can see this is the home page to be able to edit the specific product page you're going to have to click this option over here on the top this drop box and you will see here products and when you click this you will be able to edit a theme or edit the page of a product but right now we don't have any product so what we're going to do is we're going to add a product to our store first so going here on our home page again click on products over here below orders then over here we're simply going to click on add your products over here and let's create a very simple product for us to use. Let's say our product that we would like to sell is a coffee mug. Just like that. The description. You can generate text. Coffee mug. Uh, let's generate text. It's going to use an AI to generate as our own description, which is very useful. And uh, keep. There we go. And let's see. I don't think it copied it, so let's do it again. Coffee mug and generate text. And let's wait for this and let's simply copy this text that it has created for us. Keep. And there we go, we have this one already. Then over here, you could add your media, your different images. Then you can edit your pricing. Let's say the pricing is 100 or 1000. Let's add this as our media over here, our coffee mug. Then you could do like the status, the product category, product type, all of those information. 1000 again for the cost per item, track inventory, shop location. Our quantity right now is 5, let's say. Then physical product, shipping weight is 0.5 so that this information will be displayed on our product page and variants we don't have any variants and this is it for now let's click on save and now we will be able to have one product that we can see in our store now going back to our online store over here and let's wait for it to open and let's view it for the meantime preview and let's see what the current uh, product page look like this is our product over here when you open this this is what it is currently looking so we will be editing this right now let's go back to our shopify and click on customize now after that once again click on the home page over here the drop box click on products and now we have one product over here design product there we go now we can edit literally every single part of this section you could rearrange the pricing you could move this around Move to the next position like this and you will put it down over here or you could delete this actually or you could hide it you could also edit this text over here you won't be able to edit the text in this section you will have to edit it directly at the product page so basically in this section where you edit the style you're only editing the design you're not really editing too much or like exact information about it but you can also click this on this photo you could enable sticky content on desktop. You could make the media small, medium, or large, which will change the size of this image, as you can see. Smaller now. Or you can make it larger, which will make it larger. And constraint media to screen height. The media fit is original. Desktop layout is stock. The media left position is left. As you can see, it will change. If you turn it to right, the image will now appear on the right side. Then we could put it back on the left side if you like this one better. Image zoom, open click box, click on hover. And so when they hover on your image over here, it will zoom and like give you 
a better preview of the product then there's multiple stuff over here if you have a video for your product you could enable looping over here which would loop the video and there's also top padding and bottom padding over here you check out the theme setting right now the scheme is the five so you can change out your different backgrounds over here like i think is there a background that now we could change the color of the text it's white so i don't think this is the one oh that we are trying to look for and you can see here also like the preview of the entire thing you have your header over here your announcement bar your header you could add a section over here by clicking this you could add a custom liquid and for the product information you have your text title price variant picker and most of this stuff are not customizable as you can see here not customizable you can click on the buy button you can check out this show receipt information from gift cards or products and this also quantity selector as you can see no customizing bill settings available you could add more block into this actually like a pop-up collapsible role inventory status product rating complementary products stuff like that let's say i would like to show like a product status or like how much our product has and then let's zoom it a bit it's a bit how it's a bit hard to see but as you can see here below it's saying low stop five left and we could add more like let's say product rating we could that add that as well and let's click on our section over here product rating right now we don't have any but as you can see here, we would need to add a product rating app, which is one of the applications that we could add to our Shopify store. And you could add more things like icon with text, complementary products, collapsible, pop-up, depending on your preference on what you would like to have on your store over here. You could also see over here and add bar section, all of those stuff. You could also add stuff on your footer, like over here. You could also go to the team over here save it for now we could fix our stock this is our preview of our team right now this is what it would look like in real life you could click this you could change the logo or you could add a logo on your store change the colors over here change the scheme to all of those stuff and typography over here where you could change the font that you are seeing right now on your screen you're going to have to go to the typography settings to be able to edit the font that you are using for your store there's also animations over here layouts and many more settings that you could play around and help with your product over here now it will be different when you check here it will be you can edit different pages for your product as you can see right now there's only one product but if you would like to have a custom page for another type of product you could do that as well you can also create a template over here as you can see create a template to customize how your content is displayed and after it's published you could assign it to the shopify admin then let's say let's give it a name product one then create a template and let's see now it will save the specific template that we have created we didn't do much with our design over here but it will now have this as a default template if ever we would like to assign it to one of our sections for example we added another product and of course the design or the template for that specific product that we have just added is going to look like a normal design of a product but you can now have or you can now use this template that we have used or created as a template as a basis for the other products as well and when you exit you could preview it over here you could refresh it and you will be able to see the changes that we have made we haven't done much changes but those are the things that you could edit on your product page on shopify as you can see we can see the stock over here like this is now rearranged you can click this to zoom in as you can see you can zoom in on our product over here and you can simply click on add to cart and buy it same thing with how you use a normal Shopify store. And that's it guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.